This morning in our series Red Carpet Confidential, The Secrets of Celebrity Hair, stylist Ted Gibson has groomed many of Hollywood's luxurious manes. Pretty nice resume. Thank Ted Gibson, you. good morning. Good morning. Thanks so much for being here. Thanks for having me. So you would know, what are your predictions for this year's red carpet? What hairstyles will we see? Well, you know, I always think it's going to be an old school Hollywood look with a chic sophistication. So what that means to me is several different things. French twist, chignons, mm -hmm. hair extensions, sexy waves. I don't know any woman that doesn't want to feel sexy. All right, we're going to show us how to accomplish this at home. We have our three lovely models. Let's start with Kristen, who's showing us a French twist. Yeah, well, you know, Kristen, um, when she came to me, we talked about how easy it is to do a French twist. Uh, most, of, most women use a little clip in their hair, but what we've done is we've actually twisted it up into the back, into this really beautiful shape t throughout the back. And one easy way to do it is to bring your hair all the way through mm -hmm. and then just twist it all the way up. But you always want to make sure that you tip the ends under That's so that you can key. get a really beautiful, sophisticated look. You think look. you could do this at home, Kristen? Yes. Definitely. All right. Let's show us how we actually would do one of these at home. Jessica is going to wear a classic chignon. Show us how to do that. Well, you know, the, the most important thing when you're doing a chignon at home is to always start with a really good base. And that good base is a ponytail. So for uh, Jessica, what we've done is we've actually put the ponytail in the center of the head. Mm -hmm. So if you wear it on the higher part of the head, then it lends, tends to be a little more youthful. So Sarah Jessica Parker is one person who wears a... Way, way, way up here. Way up on the top and then flips yeah. it under and has a little bit of texture. So depending on where you are in a position on the head kind of gives you, you know, it, it evokes a feel. How so, much do you want to tease the crown? You can back home the crown. Yeah? Yeah, depending on how you're feeling. If you're feeling like you want a little bit more zhuzh, then go ahead and tease the crown. Zhuzh. A little right. zhuzh. So show us how so a with Jessica, works. with the chignon, I put an, an elastic at the, at the base of the head, mm -hmm. as well as one on the ends. Mm. And all you do is you twist from there and twist it on itself. Make sure always to put the ends under. I feel like I'm back in ballet class. Do you? <laughs> So and this is a classic chignon. You can't go wrong with that. You can't it's go so wrong elegant. Without easy. Piece it's great cake. for the um, a night on the town. This is a definite way that uh, Annie Hathaway has wore her hair. I've done re many red carpet events with her hair like that. I and love then it. just follow up with just a little bit of spray just to secure it in place. Okay, thank you, Jessica. Alice is demonstrating the romantic wave. I know, hi. Right? So sophisticated, chic waves, as you can see, on one side is a little fuller, and the other side is a little flat, right? Right. So what you would do... So you're gonna you show us how you accomplish how you this fullness? Accomplish the fullness. Okay. So you section off the hair, just like so. You take a clip-on hair extension, which are very easy. I'm actually gonna be launching them on QVC on March the 28th. You clip them in. Hair extensions at home. Hair extensions Look, at home. Just a little home. clip. How just easy is that? Just a little clip. And depending on how much fullness you want, I've added one. Now watch this. I'm going to add another. So this is classic uh, Deborah Messing. This is what mm. I do on Deborah Messing all the time. When Annie Hathaway, before her hair got all cut off, this is what I would work with her. And this is the same thing. So I want to ask you what every woman should have in her evening bag. I have my morning bag. You do? Which is known as the Maggie bag. <laughs> yeah, the Show Maggie me if bag. I have the right stuff in it. Let's see, what's in there? Numero uno. Fabulous. Little hairspray. Travel size hairspray. You can never, ever go wrong with travel size hairspray. Powder and lip gloss. Powder and, and lip it. gloss. A little bit of breath mint. Let's see, these are my favorites. Yes, I do. I and you know, I see that you have eyeliner. Perfect. Oh. I think you're really ready, car red carpet ready. We didn't even plan this. Thank you so much, pleasure. ladies. Ted Gibson, pleasure having you.